Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of my campaign. I know it's been a while. Um, I thought I was not going to be busy this summer, but I actually turned out to be busy because I was working for actually a lot of the day, most of the time. Uh, so that's why it's been so long since I've got my last video up. Sorry about that. And last week I was out of town, so that's why nothing came up then. But here I'm just going to go through and uh, upgrade some of the factories. My mouse has been acting strangely lately, so you might get to see that happen, happen during this episode when um, it just stops working. so many factories now. It actually takes a while to do this. Okay. So let's start time. lagging for some reason. Just see something on it. Ah. Uh. Seems like it's taking longer and longer to save and load this game. I don't know why that is, but... See, everyone else has a higher population than me. Well, okay, not those two, but... That's a bunch of factories being built. Yeah, it's these. Well, some of them. It's a lot of factories. It's over. Let's do that. It took forever.
people are happy. Wow. No rebel. Well, no. Revolt first. Slowly the time is moving because this computer's lagging out. It's annoying. Sometimes if you zoom out, it goes faster because then it doesn't have to do all this automation showing everything. It's going a little bit faster. Now. I don't know where that is. Uh, how much is happening right now? In the world, I mean. I don't really want to start a war or anything. Because, I don't know, it seems like the further along you go in this game, it's the. Uh, well, maybe not there, but. The more countries ally with each other, and then it gets harder and harder to start a war. Like this, you see, Prussia and Russia. Like, that's just, like, overpowered shouldn't be allies like that. I told you this already, I'm pretty sure, but I have uh, Europa Universalis 3, and I actually think some things in that game are better than in, in uh, Victoria 2, because it seems that, like in this game, if you start with the most uh, recent patch, like not in this campaign though, because we didn't do that, um, but if you do that, then I think the diplomacy is really messed up, uh, so like, you'll get... Britain and France allied and stuff, and they'll always be intervening in your wars and everything. Well, especially Britain, which makes playing, you know, the United States pretty difficult, because they're always doing that. Taking so long. Yeah, this is not going to be um, a very long episode, though, I think. Right, I'm going to check the world trade for... Uh, people are making barrels? Wait. making barrels, but for some reason the price changes. People are making airplanes.
people are making fuel also. So why am I not buying any fuel? Oh, I need automobiles, that's it. Automobiles. Here they are. Seen they're being produced also. I don't know why that's... Right. I remember something. I was supposed to research assembly line. Instead of... Well, it's okay. That's what I was trying to remind myself to do. Last episode. Yeah, all the like colony people migrated into here to Europe. Only in mine, though, not in the other countries, it seems. Rebellion. You're not gonna win. Okay, now we can get that. Maybe it's this. No. It's now 1930, which means almost done, which I'll actually be happy about, um, because I don't think there is a lot to see, a lot, I don't think a lot is going to happen in this Let's Play.
look at this. So, I mean, the countries that are... Looks like they're increasing their production of um, automobiles. Maybe it's just because they're all using them for themselves that they're not really going on the world market or something. Bremen. Mm, probably not the best country to be allied with. Let's just look at this. Has no ne has no units. No, I don't really want to do that. Herman strikes state. That's Lindy. Uh, that's over here, I think. So I always remember in the beginning of the game. It was like Portugal demands Omani Lindy in every single game. Oh, so it's, a, it's just these two. Oh, wait. What the? No, it's. I have the inlet. Never mind. I'm not Portugal. Okay. Um, let's aid them. Yeah. $1,000 is nothing. Like, even a million wouldn't be a lot. Well, okay, fine. It would be a lot just for this kind of event, but still. factories being built. was a I was getting excited I thought it was a tank or armor unit or whatever it's called in this game but nope it's not all right I am going to go now because the shorter episodes are easier to post anyway I hope you enjoyed and if I have free time I could maybe make some more this week but I don't know thanks for watching <laughs>